Hey guys, thanks for stopping by. I'm Elliot, this is Everything Elliot. Behind me is my Kubota L4701, and what we're doing with it today, we're taking it back in the food plot. Now, a couple videos ago, my buddy Steve and I were back there cutting down a bunch of trees. It was actually over winter, but it's been so muddy that I haven't been able to get the tractor back there and clean it up. I have been back there the majority of the day today, but I only had the pallet forks on moving some logs around. Really wasn't that exciting. Now the little sticks and branches and this, that, and the other are starting to get in my way, so we're gonna get the grapple out, we're gonna go clean them up, and it's going to be a perfect test for all this, uh, all the wood chippings that I put in my trail. The grapple itself weighs around 700 pounds. Tractor's probably about 4,000, and I've got a counterweight on the back that's got about 800. So this will be the most weight that this will probably ever have on it. Um, so we're going to set the tripod up on the other side, see if the tractor sinks, and we'll go from there. Hopefully it doesn't. Hopefully we can get back there. It is about 85 degrees out today, so... There's about a 90% chance that my iPhone overheats and stops recording. If it does, I apologize in advance. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. So if you've seen any of my videos, you know this is my trail to my food plot and it has always been super muddy. The ruts got to about two foot deep where I was framing out the tractor and it was time to do something with it. So I got a bunch of chips from my buddy. I have a video on it, so even check that out. I'll put a link up top for you guys. We're gonna see how it holds up to the tractor with some weight on it. bad very impressed I know this is gonna break down over time but I could just get more wood chips and put them on top it's it's worth it I wouldn't have been able to get through there without them so I've been back here most of the day I'll show you guys what I've got done so far I stacked all these uh, logs up with the pallet forks it was uh, pretty uneventful but they're in about half tree length and now I'm just starting to get a bunch of brush and stuff's in my way so I want to clean up a lot of the brush make a brush pile somewhere over there so I can have a fire. I honestly don't know what the best camera angle is going to be for you guys. Maybe I'll just put you where I'm picking the stuff up because dumping it is really not not that eventful. So stay tuned. Stuff like this, this is what's really slowing me up. All that just brush laying around, getting in my way and what have you. So we're going to try to clean some of that stuff up.
So I gotta figure out what my next plan of attack is gonna be. Um, as you can see, I've got a ton left to do behind me. And there's still a lot of trees that are down and they're still tree length. What I've been doing is just picking them up with the forks and cutting them in half, putting them on the pile. Now that I've got the gravel on, that makes it a little more different because I can't come in at an angle. I need to get them straight on. So I think I'm just gonna tool around, uh, see what I can grab here and there and, and whatnot. The Kubota is pretty strong. It'll probably pick up, I mean, not a huge tree, but a decent sized tree. So yeah, I'm gonna get to work, um, figure out what I need to do. So I'm just gonna keep at it. I don't know. I don't know what the best course of action is here. It's probably pretty windy out, huh? Yeah. So I got a pretty good brush pile going so far. Um, things are going well. The Titan attachment scrap is working as it should. I've had this thing for about two years and I beat the absolute snot out of it. It's uh, held up pretty well. I broke a couple, uh, not a couple, I broke one. I broke one support bar. Um, yeah, I'm just, I think that's gonna be about it. I don't know if I want my brush pile much bigger than that. It hasn't rained in about, phew. Three weeks now so everything's pretty dry you know, I don't want to I don't want it getting too big and burning down the whole county so I'll probably uh, leave it at that burn it start piling again burn it start piling again burn it well that's gonna be it for today's video hope you guys enjoyed make sure you subscribe don't forget to hit the like button too it really helps me out uh, I don't have much else check out some of the other videos I don't know you might like something you might not you might hate it all who am I to judge so until the next one have a great day